it's night. It's scary. Boom, there's a bus. I've got, uh, hopefully this extension cord will reach. I've got uh, four North Star AGMs in my bus. And I charged them before I put them in there. It's difficult to plug in when you're working on your hands. But anyways, I don't have a meter hooked up to them yet. You can get up in here and fall and die and nobody would find it. It's dark. Definitely dark. Got to get some lights in here. This is some cheap round lights from Amazon. That's one. I think if I have three or four per room, or two or three, maybe three in the bedroom, two in the bathroom, and four or five or six up front, that should be enough light. I don't know. But anyways, back to the batteries. I've got four of the North Star batteries. I don't know if I've showed them to you yet or not. But I noticed that they're down in voltage. Twelve point five volts. Now that's not bad. I mean I don't know how long the battery bank's gonna last. On the other half of my extension cord. I don't know how long the battery bank will last. I was trying to think of what I've done with it. I've run the furnace for about 24 hours. off that battery bank. Hold on, I gotta set you down. Look at the inside of this fuse box while I'm putting this in. I've run the, uh, I got an old, old suburban furnace, so I'm sure it's efficient as nothing. I've been running that for almost 20, 24 hours. And then a the few piddly things, the radio I ran for a day. But I would think the batteries would last longer than that. Maybe not. Wish I knew what EE meant. This battery charger, it's a smart ba smart battery charger. Lithium, lead acid, um, lithium ion, what is it, Lith lithium phosphorus, which I don't know much about. Uh, it actually works on AGMs. It kind of classifies them as lithium when it's in the charger, but so far it's the 30 of them that I've charged and tried to 
fix with this, it's worked. light flicker. I'm actually going to keep this light in this utility closet. I'll put it on a switch, obviously. Man, I wish I knew what that meant. I have to come back out before bed and check on that and see. Be sure that it's charging. I'm going to charge those house batteries up. I'm thinking about getting a second one of those chargers and installing it for the coach batteries. I don't know. Haven't done much. Been working on that panel right there. It's gonna go above the radio. It'll have a house voltmeter, it'll have a chassis voltmeter, and of course the hour meter. Uh, no odometer in this bus. But that hour meter works, and I believe it to be accurate. 13,400 hours, I think it is, off that engine. Which probably makes sense. Watch out, cats. Which probably makes about sense, because I'm pretty sure it's been overhauled before Greyhound got rid of it. i tell you another thing. The camera system stays plugged in. That works off the house batteries. So, I don't know. Maybe, 12, yeah, 12.5 should be fine. I don't think that's... Go, cat. It's not really bad. I just, I like to see them at 13. I tell you, another project I'm going to try to do, which could turn into a complete train wreck, make that bad boy be my waste water tank. I plan to split it down the middle and shrink it down so it fits in the bay. We'll have to see how that goes. Like I say, not a whole lot going on. I haven't done much in this weekend um, on the old bus here. But just kind of piddling around with some stuff that I had, you know, get that installed, get it up out of the way. I still want to get some more cleaning done in there. I've got the furnace installed so I can heat it now when it gets cold. Of course, it's in the high 70s this weekend. But the cold weather's here. Um, got a couple more wires to plug into the uh, electrical box I can get that all buttoned up I don't know why they don't put quick latches on that you gotta have a screwdriver I don't like that same thing with that toolbox or that front box below I don't think there's anything I can do about it and probably never ever gonna change them but it's something I don't like but like I say that's just kind of what's going on you know nothing major taking a little break from it 